Mach 10 Garage. with that gay shit, dude. Oh! There's nothing gay about it. I was hanging out with Jake the other day. He's like, yo, we should go for a hike. I was like, that's gay. I said, I wanted to show you this cool Just spot. Just me and Jake. I was like, that's There's nothing gay, gay about it. You, It would only be gay if I was fucking like putting my dick anywhere near you. Which right, just the, just the fact that you think about it normally fucking hiking. means I'm never going to go on a hike with you. Today, Mach 10 Garage this baby's a little too loud for inspection. As you can see, I'm a little bit behind. Got that two sticker on. Bang, bang, ski, ski. So today, we're gonna be putting the exhaust back on. Let's, let's hope it goes well. Pulling the Jeep is a little, you know, it's a little too loud for inspection. So we uh, dug up his uh, old muffler from the fucking Bermuda Triangle is what it looks like. It's all crusty and stuff, but we're gonna try to make this work. As you can see, it's got like STDs growing on it. And we're gonna go like this. Clamp her, clamp her down nicely, and then fabricate a straight pipe to mount onto that. Colin is currently test fitting the exhaust tailpipe section. Right now, me, see money head mechanic at Mach 10 Garage. I am snaking my exhaust back in where it's supposed to be. Sliding her into this hook. Then from there, oh, what's, what seems to be the issue here? Minor technical difficulties. Okay, like a glove. So now, we gotta go put the muffler back on. And this will hold this thing about right here so it's not just like hanging. And uh, should be nice and quiet for inspection. Then we're gonna rip this bitch back off. Look at that. It's fucking mint. That's what you call a straight pipe right there. So basically, when you're, wanna, when you're mounting a muffler, if you don't have access to a welder, you wanna use these things called exhaust clamps. Uh, this one's a little old. He got new ones, luckily. Uh, but basically all this is is like a pipe clamp. You put it around the pipe after you take these off. And once you put it around the pipe, you can tighten these down and it crimps down the exhaust pipe a little bit. See how it's like indented a little bit? And it just kind of creates a decent seal to hold it together. Just to get you through like inspection or, you know, if you don't want any bad, crazy exhaust, you, just, you should be good. So this is one of the new clamps. What Colin's gonna do is put this on top where the muffler meets the pipe that's already on the car, put this on top, put this on the bottom, put two bolts and tighten it down. Okay, so what I try to do is, you see how this is it's two different parts. I like to put one on one side of the pipe, look where it comes on to this other pipe, and then one on the pipe we're putting it on to. That way it pulls them together and get a good uh, crease. Dude. See this? This is safe. <laughs> see money special. You gotta stop playing with that because I do need to pass inspection. Okay, if you you wanna see what it looks like under here, boys. Yeah, we got no rockers. All the way down. That's a nice pipe right here. I can tell you where else to find some nice pipe. Link will be in description. in the description. <laughs> <laughs> this is also what happens when your car is unsafe for the road. Come take a look. We got a fat dent here. We got a fat dent here. We got a nice body line here that got obliterated. And we got a nice tight antenna. Ratchet. No, don't give me your girlfriend. Give me the ratchet. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> ow, ow.
Stop. So gay, dude. How do you like that pipe? Looky here. I may have found it. Okay, so right here. End of the muffler. We got a two and a quarter ID. And this is a two and a quarter OD. So I bought this nifty piece. It's a two and a quarter ID OD. So this side is gonna fit over here and yet still penetrate. <laughs> I repeat, penetrate this pipe. It's a really tight fit. I was having a hard time laying down underneath there and trying to slide this pipe over the two and a quarter ID OD. So I put it in as much as I can. I'm gonna put this piece of wood so I don't bash in the end of my tailpipe. It's probably still gonna bend it since it's at an angle. Not, and you can't really hit it like that because you gotta hit it straight in. But this will protect it a little bit. So I'm just gonna hit it from the back. Yeah, she's probably in there. I have terrible balance. But why, you're like shorter than me. You have like a lower center of gravity. All right, Jake, you see, I have a high gravitational pull going in this general area. Actually here. Ah. So that should be like pulling down, it should help. No, so once I get moving, I'm getting pendulum action, it throws it all off. Yeah. Exactly like that. This is except, a, this is like this where except I got like a hammer. It's got like a, this little thing at the end? No, it's a big old meat hammer. Last leg of the journey. Putting on the final clamps, we're gonna put one here, one here, and one in this area. <laughs> and uh, she should be good for inspection tomorrow. Okay, exhaust is all clamped in. Let's uh, let's see if she's she's quiet. It's yeah, quiet. It's quiet. In conclusion to this video, as you can see, just slapped on a exhaust for this pig. She's a lot quieter. We're ready to get a new sticker. Going tomorrow, I'll let you know how it goes. Jake, anything to add? Well, it's March 19th, and that sticker is good till the end of February. So you've been illegally driving for the last month. Quick maps. <laughs> Peace out, boys. Link. All right. <laughs> like <laughs> and subscribe. Gang, <laughs> gang.